Yo, what is up, bros? This is a Brumanati back with Age of Civilizations 2 with the time lapse of our just completed Napoleonic Wars, French Empire Battle of the First Coalition with bonus, I might add, bonus footage at the end where I wreck my allies. After I posted the last video where I wrapped this up, I noticed that uh, Denmark Norway had a negative feeling about me, which pissed me off after all I had done for everybody. So I just went ahead and wrecked everybody. Now it will, it's going to pop up defeated. For some reason, after I owned every single province, the game would not end and, and then loop into the uh, time lapse. So I had to surrender to get to the time lapse. So anyways, let's go ahead and get this started. Remember, it took us a while to get going because um, everybody was attacking us. Portugal instantly wrecked Spain completely and utterly. Was not expecting that whatsoever. That was a that was a pretty decent shocker. Austrian Empire, you know, spreading out a little bit. Bavaria spreading out a little bit. Spain reappears. I think our first major war was. Bavaria. You know, just slowly creeping into S Central Europe. Starting to get a little bit of uh, Northern Italy campaign going. Spain wrecked again. The Ottomans get wrecked. Spain reappears yet again. Ottomans tr attempt a comeback just to get beat back by, who's that, M uh, Moldavia? Yeah. There we go, first major war taking out Bavaria. Austrian Empire cleared out Moldavia. Spain attempted a comeback and got beat back yet again. By Portugal. Russia pretty much seals the fate of the Ottoman Empire. I wreck Portugal and the UK forces in the Iberian Peninsula. And there's the Russian Empire finishing off the Ottomans. Boom! Right there, UK gets wrecked. Austrian Empire expands a little bit more. Denmark, Norway, Austrian Empire got it for a while until I join in and absolutely wreck them. Uh, give Spain back their territory. Make the uh, sister states. Give Netherlands back their territory and go at Austrian Empire another time. <laughs> And then prepare for the invasion of the Russian Empire. Although um, Denmark, Norway, and uh, Venice get a head start on me. Venice takes out the entire Russian Empire in the Balkans. And Denmark, Norway heads into north, northern Russia. There they go. Venice was... Venice surprised me. They were a lot stronger than I had give, given them credit for. Oh, that was the Ragusa Empire. Remember that? Our first battle with the Russian Empire. Oh, yeah, this was the point. I was two million in the hole. And it took me forever to get out of it. I had so many rebel problems. I couldn't assimilate. I couldn't throw festivals to increase happy. I was just totally screwed here. Trying to, you know, build up for France-Russia 2.0. Denmark-Norway thinks they're going to do a little something in uh, 
Russian Empire territory, they kind of get beat back a little bit. Netherlands steps in, and I'm just like, hold on, I, I better, I better go in. Boom. France, Russia, 2.0 completed. Remember, it took four times, four battles with the Russian Empire to finally put them down. 3.0. And then all they got left is a little bit in the Middle East. I was like, there's no way it should take four turns. And somebody was just like, well, they had a lot of territory. But then I reminded them, like, okay, that's cool. I went against them World War II with Germany. They had three times as much territory, and it only took me going at them twice. So I realized Denmark, Norway does not like me. Boom, take them out. Spain joins in on their side. So does Netherlands. And then, boom, take out the sister states. Fight through a couple rebels. And we are done. The completion of the French Empire. And... A very positive outcome for Napoleon's invasion of the Russian Empire. Bros, if you're enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap the like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And I will be back here for our next upload. Peace. Brumanati. Out.